Here's a short video to show you how to do the remote operation on an Omron FZ4. The unit we have in front of us is an FZ4 uh, 4.0 controller. This one happens to be the one with the touchscreen. It doesn't have to be. You could use the one that's a CPU with a separate monitor and mouse. Um, we have the computer and the vision system connected together over Ethernet. They both have local IP addresses set. Uh, in this case we're using 192.168.250 and then I have the laptop as uh, 50 and the vision system as 100. The first step to setting this up would be to activate the remote operation on the FZ controller. So we go to system, controller, startup setting, select the communication tab, turn on the remote operation, select OK. Gives us a note that we need to save and reboot, so we'll do that. Let's save. And we'll reboot the controller. You can hear that start up. Well, that's starting up, I'll let you know that there's a, a couple of things about this. One, that the remote operation tool is a free software from Omron. It's available in different versions. And to do this properly, you would want the remote operation tool to be the same version as the FSET that you're using. In this case, the FSET is version 4.0, so the remote operation tool is also 4.0. This remote operation can be done locally or direct, as I'm doing here, directly on an Ethernet cable. It can be done through a plant network, or it can be done through the internet and uh, remotely teach and, and troubleshoot any problems. That's where the real power of this tool can come in. Uh, if you do have plant network security, you may need a VPN to get past the security on that case. So now that the FZ4 is rebooted and up and running, we can come over to the laptop. Here's our remote software. And click on the Browse button. It automatically selects the IP address of the FZ that's connected. Click OK. And start. And as simple as that, we now have the FZ software running on the computer. Anything we do here is active on the computer itself. So we could edit the flow, we can make changes to the program, we can save, download, anything it is we wish to do directly here. While we're doing this on the FZ, it has a note saying that it's being remotely operated. If at any time you want to take control back in the local system, you can click OK on this button. The FZ is back in control and the remote operation has been terminated. Just select OK on that window and it's closed. Simple as that.